Hey everyone, uh, I'm aware of a new trailer, well I've actually seen it, I've seen it once, of Alien Romulus, and I wanted to check it out with you guys, and we'll just talk about it a little bit. So let's go on full screen, and have a listen, and have a watch. Okay, um, there's a couple of things I want to talk about here. Uh, first of all, I'm a massive Alien fan. I adore the first film. I love the second film. Um, that's about where it stops for me. I also love Alien Isolation, the video game. Uh, I've played that multiple times. It's terrific. Uh... <clears throat> One of my first questions is, is this a continuation off of Ridley Scott's Prometheus and Alien Covenant? It looks like no. It looks like this is... Uh, I think it said produced by Ridley Scott, so he's got... He's not directing it or anything. Uh, so this is a, a, a deviation from what we've been seeing. Now, some people really didn't like Prometheus and Alien Covenant. And they are... I understand, they are quite a mess. Although I have a particular affinity to Michael Fassbender's David character. Uh, I think he, Michael Fassbender is uh, a, an amazing actor. He's like the best. And him as David is such a compelling character. And I wanted to see more. And I wanted to see his... Uh, you know, the culmination of his story in, like, the third installment, but I don't think we're getting that. Unless he shows up in this, but I don't think so. Uh, so, yeah, so I love Alien, Aliens, Alien Isolation. Hell, I even like Alien vs. Predator, the film. The second one's awful. Uh, uh, the Alien vs. Predator video game um, on Xbox... That I just love the world of Alien, H.R. Geiger, all this scary stuff. But, uh, well, yeah, so let's have a look at look at some of these visuals. Uh, straight away, I've got the volume down so you can hear me. Straight away, we've got... Uh, so, Fed, Fede Alvarez. Okay, I'm not familiar with him. Um, I, I, I love the visuals. I... Look at this. It's, it's like I'm playing Alien, Alien Isolation. Uh, the, it's like the doors from the Nostromo. Uh, director of Don't Breathe. Well, that doesn't impress me too much because if I remember Don't Breathe, it wasn't very good. And same thing with uh, Evil Dead. I don't like Evil Dead. I think they're referring to the show, that the, the sort of newest show that they did. Never saw that. I'm talking about the films. I never like the films. I think they're a mess. Uh, so this isn't in giving me too much hope, but thankfully the visuals and the content and the context of everything that we're seeing is I'm very excited. So, I mean, look at these visuals. Look at that. <clears throat> and this is horrifying. Listen to it. So that that's horrifying to me. Uh, that of her, you can hear her in absolute horror and terror. That really scares me. 
And uh, even though this is just a teaser, this isn't even a trailer, this is a teaser. Uh, so that gets a one score, one for me. Uh, look at all these face huggers breaking out. Uh, great visuals, throwing the flares, just like in the movies. Uh, I, I reckon he he is a sin... Ooh. I reckon we got this guy here who looks like an android. Uh, just because of his... We, we see him for a couple of frames, but he seems emotionless and, you know, like an android. And then we get... Looks like a removal of a face hugger. Ugh, disgusting. Uh, explosions, turmoil, everything's going to shit. Look at this. Doesn't she look like Ripley? Doesn't it just bring you back? And then... <laughs> I think that was an edit for the trailer. I don't think that really happens. Uh, but I really like the look of this girl... Uh, she looks, just the shot, it looks like aliens, you know, when she's got the pulse rifle and the flamethrower. Uh, look at her there. It looks hot. It looks scary. She's stressed. Uh, and she's got this sort of, uh, I was looking at this before. Is that the, I don't think that's a pulse rifle. It looks like a different kind of gun. Like the legendary pulse rifle, which I want to get one, like a replica. Let's have a look. Uh, it could. I'm not sure. No, the other one. No, it it looks it looks different. It looks different. Now let's just have a look at Romulus. What is Romulus in re reference to Alien? Isn't Romulus the home planet of the Romulans in Star Trek? I think it is. Uh, let's have a look at some of these credits. Uh, Scott Free, so that's, um, and Brandywine Productions, that's R Ridley Scott. Uh, Fede Alvarez, I'm not sure who he is, we'll have a look at him. Um, let's, I'm just looking for, who does the music? Only in theatres, so it is coming to theatres, that excites me, I'm ready to go to the movies, watch a scary movie, the movies, scary movies today are not scary, uh, I want to be scared again, I want to watch something like this, and I'm going to get popcorn, and I'm going to sit down, and I'm going to, it's going to be fun, uh, I'm just looking for, I don't know director of photography, I'm just trying to see if I recognize any names, but from this teaser, from this literally one minute teaser, it looks, looks like it has a lot of potential. Um, uh, is it going to be woke or anything? If you're a viewer of mine, you know, I don't like the woke stuff as the majority of us humans don't. Uh, we don't like being lectured to. Uh, I don't detect any really wokeness in this. I did see a bald girl, which is <laughs> a little bit... Uh, they got like the the diverse casting with the the android dude and, but nothing is uh, offensive to me. No, uh, even having a, a, a female protagonist that is totally alien. Uh, it, I mean, it start it basically started with Alien with Ellen Ripley, so it comes full circle. I'm cool with that. Uh, yeah, so I don't detect any wokeisms. We'll find out when it comes out, and if there is, I will report on it. Uh, but so far, looking really good, really excited, and, I mean, just that opening bit, it, it horrifies me of her. Let's listen to it one more time, okay? absolutely horrifying and I didn't even see anything just just some blood just a that wasn't even ah my god so scary so I'm excited as a huge um alien fan I'm really excited and I hope you are too so yep I'm gonna go see this in the movies with some friends and I'm really excited so excellent uh thank you for watching and if you could please 
like and subscribe that would really help me i'm just new i'm just beginning so that would really help me so i'd appreciate it a lot thanks very much and i'll see you out in the stars all right see you later